Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to local music and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today we're once again back for another songwriter showcase inside Soul Belly Barbecue on Main Street in Las Vegas' downtown arts district, hosted by Hal Savar. These showcases are quickly becoming a breeding ground for amazing local talent and a bit of a Room 6 reunion. So uh, since this is a holiday show and everyone seems to be in a festive mood, Time to break out the dancing shoes. This video is brought to you by Audiobooks Now. We'll hear more about them later, but for now, on with the show! Like most of the Soul Belly showcases, this one was also live streamed by yours truly. If you'd like to check out the live stream from this event, there's a link down below for that as well. Additionally, if you'd like to be featured on Room 6, whether reviewed, interviewed, or both, hit me up using my email address down in the description, or click the Room 6 social media link for ways to contact me, where else I'm online, and ways to support the channel if you so desire. Thanks! Kicking things off like usual was our host, Hal Savar. Whether alone or with his band, Hal can captivate an audience and command their attention. His music is full of backstory and passion for the art of songwriting, and he never fails to set the bar high for the next act. As always, he did a great job warming things up for the rest of the show. Following Hal were the talented brother duo, Liam and Dylan. Quickly becoming favorites on the showcase stage, these two songwriters do a great job of harmonizing with each other, both vocally and musically. It's clear they have a bright future ahead of them, and I'm so glad to be here in the early days. Up next was Spencer Hinton, front person for the amazing band Kook, and member of the band Elevated Undergrounds. Performing some previously unperformed music, Spencer's set enthralled everyone with a voice that soared and dipped around passionate and emotional lyrics. They took their time with the new music, letting every note breathe, and giving it an almost experimental feel, with some non-traditional chord structures peppered throughout. What a great trial run for some previously undiscovered music. One of the showcase regulars, David Wax, hit the stage. Adding a keyboard to his stage setup this time, David also introduced some music some of us hadn't heard before. He's a master at storytelling and getting catchy little earworms into your brain. You owe it to yourself to check out his music. Bringing youthful enthusiasm and an old soul vibe to the stage, Cam Elise was the next performer. This young phenom has quickly captured the hearts and admiration of every member of the Songwriter Showcase family, and this time was no different. Her writing, both vocally and musically, seems to come from a more seasoned person, yet it's approachable enough that her friends want to hear it too. Treating the crowd to a duet for a song, Hal and Spencer did their studio version of Vegas. While this wasn't the first time we had heard this song from Hal, it was a nice surprise to most of us to hear Spencer jump back on stage to help out. I can't wait to hear the full studio version. Up next was a surprise instrumental set from new showcase performer named Daniel Alejandro. While new to the showcase, it was immediately obvious that Daniel is not new to performing. Daniel put on a clinic in intricate guitar playing with complicated chord structures and dynamic control that had everyone amazed. It's a rare moment when a barbecue place goes quiet, but this was one of them. I hope we'll see him back at the showcase again soon. Up next was Joe the Associate, with some help from Casey Stickley on guitar and Mariah Cody on backing vocals. With a bit of a stripped down sound due to a lack of a rhythm section, Joe's set was a little more intimate and reminded me of his early days at the showcase. It was a nice trip down memory lane, but with some of his newer material thrown in. With Mariah and Casey's help, Joe did a nice job resetting things to a band vibe for the rest of the night. Hitting the showcase stage for the second time in a week, So Not So were up next. Where Joe and the gang brought us classic rock elements, So Not So cranks up the distortion pedal and took us back to the 90s. A tight three-piece group, they combined a little bit of alternative and a little bit of grunge into a sound that evoked nostalgia in some of us of a certain age. They did a great job setting the bar high for the last act to follow, which was... And now, a word from our sponsors. Thanks, Josh, from the past. Whether you're on tour and trying to ignore your bass player's snoring, or just trying to expand your mind while staring at mile after mile of corn, life on the road can get monotonous and downright boring. You know what would make it better? Shoving a book in your ears. 
Audiobooks Now is a digital audiobook downloading and streaming service. With their unique club pricing model, you receive deep discounts on all your purchases. Club members also enjoy rollover discounts each month and have access to exclusive discounts and offers. Club members can choose a free premium audiobook from hundreds of titles and can cancel at any time. Or, users can purchase audiobooks at their everyday low prices with no plan required. You can download or stream audiobooks from their website or their free apps, both on Apple and Android. Audiobooks Now currently offers over 80,000 premium audiobooks plus thousands of free audiobooks. Just for watching this video and for being part of Room 6, and for a limited time, you can use my affiliate link down in the description to get two months free to their club pricing, which includes 50% off digital audiobooks, a free premium audiobook, exclusive discounts, and more. Just enter coupon code PJ2M at checkout. Plus, you'll be helping out the channel. Thanks to Audiobooks Now for being a sponsor, and let's get back to today's show. Finishing things off were newcomers to the showcase stage, but old hands at putting on killer shows, Sweaterbeat. I've seen and reviewed this band in the past, represented by their singer Tierney and their guitarist Anthony, this dynamic duo also did a stripped down set of music. That doesn't mean it wasn't a full on Sweaterbeat experience though. Anthony laid down the sultry grooves on guitar as Tierney prowled the stage and worked the crowd, building up just the right amount of spicy tension before sending everyone home with a nice big smile. Overall, the latest songwriter showcase at Soul Belly Barbecue in the Arts District went great, and I'm so glad I got to check it out. See you at the next one. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you'll swing by Soul Belly Barbecue if you're in the area of Main Street in the Arts District. And I hope that you will check out all the social media handles down in the description for every act mentioned here. Uh, other than that, if you want to see more videos like this, please click up here. If you'd like to subscribe, click over there. You know the drill. And if you want to hear my own music, please click over there. Remember to be amazing, and we'll see you next time on Room 6.